in five, four, three, two, one. Give me the Norse Collection. Today we continue down the path of crafting number one lowest float CS2 skins. This is by far my craziest attempt yet because the skin we're going for is from the Norse collection. And we're not going for the cheap stuff. We're going directly to the Jurmanganders and we're attempting to craft the rank one lowest float Aug Flame Jurmangander. Of course, there's two other Jurmanganders, the P90 Astro Jurmangander and the Desert Eagle Jurmangander, which is one of my favorite skins of all time. This is the Norse collection though so this is no easy feat and not only is it gonna be hard it's also gonna be incredibly expensive I've already spent over $600 on this video in trade-up skins alone are you looking for cheap low float skins for trade-ups? Check out today's sponsor, Skins Monkey. It's the most convenient trading bot site where you don't have to overpay for low floats. I found this 0 0.08 Opelique build and this 0 0.09 M4 Tooth Fairy and the tradable M4 was delivered to my inventory instantly. If you apply code TEXTAVI, you get a 5% deposit bonus and you also get a $5 trading bonus when you start trading. Don't worry if you don't have any skins, just head over to freebies and you'll find three giveaways all the way up to a gut knife gamma doppler. So use my link in the description to start finding deals on low float skins today. But before we get into the really expensive stuff, let's do some warm-up trade-ups. We're gonna be going from consumer to hopefully all the way up to restricted. So let's start off with a 30% trade-up for the Nars Collection Industrials in 3, 2, 1. Oh yeah, Moss Quartz, let's go! I don't think I'm actually gonna trade that up because that's more expensive than the rest. And it's a 0.01 float, so that is really, really nice. Let's go! If this video reaches 300 likes, I'll give away this M4 Moss Quartz in my Discord server. So if you want to have a chance to win this M4, then smash the like button. That's all you gotta do. So instead of using this $32 Moss Quartz, I'm gonna use this $20 Mag 7 Chainmail. And we're gonna be throwing two of these into a Industrial 2 mil spec trade-up. And once again... We are praying for a Norse skin. We put it in slot number one and slot number 10. Actually, I want to put it in slot number nine. So there we go. Now it's in slot number nine. Here we go, Gaben. 33% for the mil spec in three, two, one. Norse collection. No, that's an amber fade. Oh boy, that's so painful. I guess if we want to miss a trade up, this is it. Now that we're done with the warm-up trade-ups, we need to figure out what the number one trade-up is gonna be looking like. I really, really wanted to get the Desert Eagle Yermangander into number one, but unfortunately, the current lowest float is Quintuple 07, and the Norse mil spec skin to craft that just does not exist at the price that I'm willing to pay for it. So unfortunately, that dream will have to wait, but we can still definitely beat the number one Og Flame Yermangander. And my plan for doing that includes buying this Mactan copper bore triple zero two for three hundred dollars and that's already a price that i bargained for so thank you to the owner for accepting it and this is by far the most expensive skin that i've ever used in a risky trade-up and now for the fillers we once again face the same dilemma as with the number one m4 red dd pat trade-up the question is whether or not to include quintuple zero fillers this is what the trade-up would look like and frankly i don't think it's worth it since the deagle wouldn't be number one so let's try to use all the lowest float non quintuple zero skins that I have and this is what that trade up would look like yes we are sacrificing one rank on the deagle it's going from rank 2 to rank 3 but this trade up is almost $200 cheaper but we're still facing a pretty big problem what is the blue titanium doing in the trade up while it does lower the average float a little bit it has two outcomes which means it lowers the odds of getting the Norse skin by 2% from 25% to 23% so we gotta find a way to get rid of that stupid blue titanium. Well, it's actually pretty easy. I'm just gonna replace it with the next lowest float skin that I have, an MP7 Anodized Navy. This restores the odds to 25%. It's also $12 cheaper. And the only sacrifice that we have to make is that the P90 will now be rank three instead of rank two. And I'm completely okay with that because at this point, unless it's the Emerald Yermagander or unless it's a rank one, the rank really doesn't matter. It's only the float that matters since these skins are pretty much just gonna be used in trade-ups but i've yapped for long enough it is time what slot do i use man i have one input skin 
I would put it in slot number one. Slot number one? Okay, I think slot number one was lucky in my um, finding out whether or not slots affect luck video. So I'll take slot number one. Oh boy. 25% at a skin worth over $2,000, which means I am scared. All right, boys, here we go. Ready to trade up. We're one button click away from potentially a quad zero three Desert Eagle Emerald Yermingander, or potentially even better, the rank one lowest float Og Flame Yermingander. Are you ready, Mons? I'm ready. All right, here we go. In five, four, three, two, one. Give me the Norse collection. Yes, let's go. Oh, let's oh go. My god. Two thousand oh dollars. That's rank three. Please, please tell me I didn't mess up the floats. Yes. Let's go! <laughs> oh that my. is the least good of the Norse outcomes, but I cannot complain. Yes! Let's go! Okay, um, I have to move it in the storage unit. <laughs> yeah. Storage yeah. unit. Oh Woo! my god, you did it! <laughs> no way. And there it is! The third lowest float P90 Astro Yermingander in the world with a float of Quad Zero Three. It is not registered yet just to keep the secret for the video, but I already reached out to Sparkles and he offered $2,000 for this P90. Don't forget, if you want to win this M4 Moss Quartz, smash the like, 300 likes, and I'll give it away in my Discord server. If you want to watch me attempt more crazy number ones, then I'd recommend checking out this one, where I went for the rank one. On M4 Red DD Pat from the 2021 Dust 2 collection. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next rank one trade up video.